you so much. Cheers. What's up guys, we are at Chicago Pizza Summit. It's been a while since we've been here. It's taken a few years off, but it's back with vengeance. We're in a new location. This really cool shuffleboard like club spot. That's in what, where are we at? Wicker, Wicker Park? Wicker Park, baby, yeah. They've got a bar with beer. They've got these shuffleboard spots. They've got a DJ. There's a Kushi Crouton bar. They've got all kinds of fun little side gigs. And then the main star of the show. A bunch of pizzerias here from all over the city. We're gonna do rapid fire pizza reviews. We got some friends here to help us. We're gonna get it done and let you know which are the best of the best at the summit. And you know what I'm excited about? What's that? Not only some classics, but there's some pizza joints we haven't tried yet. I'm sorry, what? Oh yeah. Which kind of blows my mind. I feel like we've gotten it blows to everyone. my mind. Like, we gotta, we gotta do our damn job. Yes, it's time. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Get some, guys. Oh, we will. Get some. We're just doing our sausage and garnier pizza. Oh, heard it. Okay. A couple of my faves. Fabulous Freddy's. We've had their breaded steak sandwich. Loved ah, it. That's right. I was trying to remember how I. Okay. Little pizza though, huh? Jeez. Sausage and jarred in there. Sausage and jarred. Mmm. Oh wow. That's damn good. That's a good way to start. Man, yeah. I'm impressed. Is that a Bridgeport location? Yes, it is, yes. We've talked about it before, Bridgeport and fire food. Absolutely amazing neighborhood. This is good salt factor. Damn. Like, I love the sauce. Jardinera spice, that's gonna be a high score right away. Yeah, this, wow. So what do I get next time I go there? Bread and steak or this? Like, my God. I think one of each. Holy crap. I am very impressed, Freddy's. Wow. One of the few pizzas here I have not had yet. So good, Freddy's. Let's go. Well done. Cheers. Cheers, bud. For Detroit style, yeah, you gotta you know go corner. You know me. Five star pizza, West Town, Detroit style. Corey knows me well, he got me a corner. Corner? Oh! You didn't say corner. Cheers, my friend. Cheers. Mmm. That's pretty good. I know it's tough when they're at these places trying to sling them out. Mm -hmm. I, this makes me want to try their like. When they're putting putting it all, you know, 100% into it. That's so good, though. More jar in there. Mm. Oh yeah, that's damn good pizza right there. Five star, well done. Very well done. Mm. Yours looks even better. You got better caramelized crust than mm -hmm. I did. Strong contender. Gonna pick our favorite at the end. That was great. Is that the jalapeno? Yeah. Dude, I'm gonna do this one. Yeah. I'm. It's very popular. popular. I'm very excited about it. The only reason we have a following 2.2 million viewed <laughs> hockey one chip challenge and the SB Kababi Bobby Hajar joining us for this slice. What'd you get? I got some sausage. Sausage, sausage, sausage boys over here. And then I got jalapeno popper, which I think is kind of a lie. I don't see any jalapeno poppers on this. Yeah, you know, liars lie. It's okay. Cheers. Cheers. Not for me. Not for not my no. This is thick and it tastes like frozen pizza in my. I wish my that opinion. there was pizza to go along with this loaf of bread. <laughs> oh my god, right? This is so much bread. Very loafy, like very bready. I love the fresh jalapenos, don't get me wrong, but it kind of tastes like cafeteria pizza. I have been trying to get the disclaimer today that these are not the ideal pizza cooking conditions. You might go to the store and get a better slice, but this wasn't it today. Take it with a grain of salt or a cup of marinara, whatever you want. <laughs> Matter of fact, if you had a grain of salt, I need to get some of this flavor out of my mouth. <laughs> what flavor? <laughs> Bobby, what's your favorite pizza in the city? It's gotta be Domino's. Domino's pizza? Hi. Hi, how's it going? Good to meet you. Doing well. Is this the Jardinera one? Yeah, this is a you make the jardinera? Yeah. Oh, okay, great. All right, we got ourselves some bocce. This is their jardinera pizza. Let's give it a go. It's cold. Come on, guys. Mr. Freeze. I'm not, I'm not, I can't even take a bite of that. That's, Damn. it's not even warm. Mr. Freeze. Yeah? I mean, you already have historically been one of my least favorite pizzas in the city. Like, bro, what are you guys doing? All right, come on. <laughs> no, are you serious? I want to see how, if mine's the same. It's cold to the touch. Oh, no. It's like I'm... Mr. Freeze wants what? In college, we used to like get food late at night and leave it on the counter and then wake up the next morning and just eat it. That's this. Ladies and gentlemen, I will tell you this. This is, uh, we are kind of going, quickly going through our least favorite pizza joints. So we got good ones coming at the end. Yes. We just want to save those as palate cleansers. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Pain is the cleanser, pain is the cleanser. You guys, very big moment. 
If you watch Number Six with Cheese or you watch Eat Local, you've definitely seen the Courtney Basinger name. And look who drove in all the way from yeah. Lowell, Michigan, just Dude. for the event. What a Give legend. it up for Courtney Basinger, everybody. Cheers. Eh? How was the drive? Perfect. Are you excited to be here? Yeah, I'm super excited to be here. I've been waiting for years. Yeah, you, ever since we did this in 2019, he's like, the next one, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. It's been four, four damn years. He's finally here. Four long years. Four long years. <laughs> Time to eat some pizza? Absolutely. Piping hot, thank God. Yeah, yeah. Demos. This is the big twist, all right? I got the mac and cheese pizza. I think Demos makes a great mac and cheese pizza. Listen to what Corey got. This is a one of the rarest Corey moves you're ever gonna see. I went with a vegan pizza because they got an elote's pizza and it just sounded so interesting and good, so. If you would've told me I was gonna wake up today and hear this guy giddy about a vegan slice. We're gonna try it though. All right, a little all Demos. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. So well cooked. It's like crispy. Oh, it's really good. Oh, oh yeah. God. I just love a taste. Throw it on anything, I'll eat it. Absolutely. Mm. Corn, corn belongs on pizza. A lot of people don't realize that. Demos is one of the kings in the city of doing like oddities on a pizza. Yep. They're great at that. So no surprise to me that they did this really well. Do you want to try a bite? They have one that is just penne noodles on pizza. Mm -hmm. Chicken penne. It's uh -huh. honestly one of my favorites. It's pretty damn good, right? Yeah. For freaking vegan, no cheese. Vegans. I don't take back everything I said about you, but I take back a little bit. <laughs> I think this is my favorite so far because That's of how well book. they know how to work a room. They're at a place where it's hard to keep pizza hot. They got it hot. They're I appreciate doing it right. that. They're doing yeah. it right. So are you guys back in Chicago again? Yeah, we're at the old post office. Oh, yeah, good yeah, to see you guys. Come see us. It's a dope building. Hang out, get work done. That's all. Awesome. Around by the river. Love that. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thanks, yeah, you guys are mounted on a chair. Dude, paper plane. We've reviewed this on number six with cheese. They left Chicago for a while. They're back. Uh, and they make some damn good pizza. My new favorite thing about this festival is the pizzerias that understand the assignment. Yeah. Well, this is tough terrain to do it right in. I like the zhuzh up. I like the preparation, dude. Paper plane. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Bro, the, the zhuzh up does it. That's, That's oil. So the oil, bro. I don't even mind. Oh my god, yeah, it's absolutely one of the better slices I've had here. This is so good. That sauce is so good. Mm. Paper plane, well done. This is my very first time trying Professor Pizza. I just met the man himself. Super nice guy. Oh. That is so good. That's a game changer. <laughs> a little bit of that ricotta. A little ricotta, the hot honey. Mm. Yeah. Five. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely five. Woo! That is delicious. I love the pesto. And the fact it's hot. You're a pesto queen. Thank you. I love a Gino's East collab. The tomato sauce is so fresh. Oh my god. I love the basil. It's just a fresh tasting piece of pizza. This has got to win. I got the pepperoni. This is the one Courtney had earlier with the uh, ricotta on it. And Courtney's trying the same one that Allie just got. This is a, looks like a pesto yeah, one. Yeah, margarita almost. It's a pesto one. Yeah, right. Give it a try. Courtney and Corey in a video together. I love it. I mean, pepper pizza is great. This is good. This is the best pizza here. I love it. I love it. All right, both. <laughs> Iconic moment. Some Lord shots. All right, boys. Cheers. 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 Colliding of worlds, as they say. <laughs> Little Malort in what looks like an old jelly jar. Not bad. <laughs> Top of the bottle. <laughs> I love those shot glasses. Woo! Fantastic. Overall, just fantastic. Guys, we're gonna pick our favorite before we get out of here, but I just wanna say real quick how fun this event is. Just having like the bar and the DJ and all these people, and we've been running into a lot of people that we've met through the food scene yeah. over the last, whatever, seven years. Love the event, it's super fun. Uh, anything else we need to say before we pick our favorite and get out of here? I think festivals like this are so great because we go to beer festivals all the time, and it kind of gets a little redundant. 
it's kind of fun that it's a food-based festival. Yeah. And there's so many local pizzerias, so I just really dig the change up. I hope there's more of this to come. Look, I could I could go for a sandwich festival, <laughs> maybe start doing a Cuban sushi. Sandwich festival, sushi. Let's go. Yeah, like let us know. Like we'll go. Big shout out Spina for putting this all together. You're a legend, man. Killed it. Yeah. Alright, how about this? On the count of three, say your favorite pizza pizzeria you had here today. Alright, I got it. Alright, drum roll please. Thank you so much. One, two, three. Paper Professor plane. Pizza! Yeah. I really like that slice. The switch up. I, I honestly, I that little juju up. I am. Did you? My face was so naturally shook. Yeah, I mean, Professor Pizza is still one of my favorite pizza joints the, in Paper the city. Paper plane was right there. It was really freaking good. Yeah, that was better than when we reviewed it in the car. I think it might have been. It, it was might unbelievable. Be. That oil drizzle was next level. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I think the takeaways are: the visit Paper Plane. You got to visit Professor Pizza. But anyways, we're gonna have some fun. Drink some. More beers. Also, shout out to Courtney for making the drive, huh? All the way from all Michigan, that. baby. World's colliding getting Courtney in a video. So, um, all right, we love you guys. We'll show you some shenanigans as we get out of here. But uh, eat local, and we'll see you soon for another video. Time for more of these. It would not be a Pizza Summit vlog without Anthony Spina in the video, who created this entire thing and has become one of our favorite people in the city. Ladies and gentlemen, Anthony Spina. Uh, Anthony. Well, uh, come here, hold on, real, real quick. I need a big group hug right now. A big group hug. Oh, the Three Musketeers of Pizza right from, Oh yeah. From day one, That's from right. the first Chicago Pizza Summit in 2016, yeah. guess who was there? These guys. I really appreciate you giving a shit about what we do. We just literally eat our jowls smack together. So the fact that you think this is art is really fun for us. And if these guys don't remember him, he sure put us into one of our best pizza experiences ever. Yes. Down south. Vito and Nick's, Vito and Nick's man. What a great experience. That was all because of this guy. Sure was. Well, great people stick around. Great people. It's what Chicago Pizza Summit's all about. That's Community, right. Community, friendship, and dialogue. Look at these guys. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Beautiful. He also started a seltzer company. We profiled that. I'm going to put all of his links below. You guys need to kind of come to Summit next year and join us. All of that info is below. Game on. From day one, the OG PB and J. Check this art out, pizza box art, coming right here for your eyes only. Look at that. That's just gorgeous right there. That's talent. Hell yeah.